Two skaters from Team Gold on the on the right. Mai Han and Mio Takagi. Mai Han, along with Zhang Yangning, came over from China to Team De Witt, Team Gold. And Mio Takagi is the original member of Team Gold. Of, uh, here, number nine. Starting from the inner lane is Mei Han of China. Johan de Witt didn't get, he, he was Japan. coach in Japan for many years, but he didn't get a new contract at the end of 2022, the 2022 Lord season. And then he just went solo with only Mio Takagi the previous season. And then this season they've built a team around her. Six skaters in total, including Ready. Takagi. Oh. Takagi, world record holder. Both just entirely and on low altitude. Takagi is also six times in the top ten fastest time skated in Obihiro, mostly from Japanese championships. She can skate the 1500s in all of the 2547, the second fastest opener of the day, a little behind Sato. And my hand can. He can go in front of Takagi, luckily. It's never nice to see a skater have to wait. As I said, Takagi can skate great first laps, middle laps and final laps. Not all in one race, of course, that's impossible. But she can do it in a lot of different ways. And she skates the fastest first lap of all. So far, anyway. 28.3 and Mai Han not bad either, with 28.8. Takagi had a little bit of a disappointing season. She skated a fantastic 1500 meters at the Japanese Championships, and after that, she did get a few medals, but not nearly as good as they hoped for and expected. Middle lap, 29.5, the fastest of everyone again. She is very far ahead of Kimi Gers. She will definitely take the lead. Question is, how fast will she go? Track record is 154.08. Can she do that? That would be very special. 154.08. And it's not going to happen, but 154.54 is a fantastic time. It's the second fastest time ever skated in Obihiro. Only Takagi herself was faster almost three years ago and half a second faster than anyone else has ever done.